The Trump administration has reached the 100 day mark and we are all mostly still alive. So give yourselves a round of applause. Woo! What? What? Hold on. As the traditional deadline approached, the president started to get real salty about it. He's like, it's arbitrary. Whoever said I was making a contract with America about all the things I was gonna do in my first 100 days? I mean, you did. My 100 day action plan to make America great again. It's a contract between Donald J. Trump and the American voter. But it's okay, I don't mind. I don't think anyone minds if you just sit on your hands for like four years or so. Just relax, golf. Don't push any buttons. I will not be happy. Not happy mean military action? I don't know, I mean, we'll see. You can actually get a lot of stuff done in 100 days, however. For the past 100 days, Beyonce has been gestating two superhumans inside of her own body. Serena Williams won a record 23rd Grand Slam title, and then 100 days later, she revealed, bloop, I was pregnant the whole time. Barack and Michelle have gone on roughly 44 vacations in the last 100 days. And maybe that doesn't sound like a lot of work, but Barack is an Instagram husband now. He's gotta make sure the light is right on Michelle, the wind is blowing in the right direction. It's hard. I think the first 100 days of not being president are probably harder than the first 100 days of being president. When you're president, you just have to do something, anything. Now we have to have a little flexibility. But when you're not president, you gotta figure out how to live the rest of your life. So congratulations everyone, Barack, Beyonce's twins. For every day of the last 100 days, you have figured out how to be alive on this planet. Clap it up for yourselves.